Hi, and welcome to this special episode of Soap Queen TV. It's time to go back to school. Can you believe it? In this episode, I'm going to show you how to make a very customized, personal, special bar of soap with Brambleberry's Flexi Fast Molding Putty. You ready? Let's get started. Now that it's back to school time, you want to make your teacher something special to show her how much you appreciate her, don't you? Well, using this FlexiFast molding putty, it's a two-part silicone molding putty that Brambleberry.com sells, you can easily customize anything. Here's part A and part B, I'll show you how to use them in a second, but first, there's lots of options of things you can make. In fact, I made this flat sheet using, well I bet you can guess, bubble wrap. It's not just for popping, you can use it for a soap mold too. No surprise, cupcakes. And then in this episode today, I'm going to show you how to make these erasers. It's the perfect back to school thing. Or you can get even more creative and do this. This is an actual bar of soap that looks just like glue. Crazy. Flexi Fast Molding Putty comes in two distinct stages. First is stage A, and you want to do 20 parts of this volume to one part of stage B. So what that looks like is like a golf ball to a little tiny marble. Or if you want to be really precise, and don't worry, you don't need to be, you can do weight. Weight wise, it's 100 parts A to six parts B. That works out to four ounces of A, two, 0.25 ounces, a quarter ounce of B. B is actually the catalyst that turns A into a super flexi fast molding putty. Ready to get started? You want to wear gloves when you're working with this product. No latex gloves. Latex gloves stick and are really messy. Take out a golf ball size of A. Mold it around a little bit. Make sure there's no clumps in it. If you work with it for about a minute before adding catalyst B, it's actually easier to work with make a depression in the middle. This is where you'll put part B. Scoop out a little bit of B. You don't need much, golf ball to marble, just a teensy bit. Put it in that depression. Now, start to work that around. This may take you two or three minutes. Just because this looks done, it's not. Do you see this? See, there is a streak. You want the entire thing to be a uniform, nice, soft pink, no streaking. This looks just about perfect. Now, cap your silicones. And now it's time to mold. First, I want you to protect your work surface. Take some clear plastic wrap, put it down over your work surface. In this case, we're gonna be using an eraser, but you could use toys, fruit, a magnet, whatever you want. Place your object down firmly. Is it even? Is it centered? Now, carefully start to spread your Flexi Fast Molding Putty over it. You can work it down pretty well, about half an inch, three-fourths of an inch thick. Are there any corners sticking through? Are there any edges that might not be strong enough to hold soap? Make sure it's thick enough in all of the areas so that you get a very even mold when this is all said and done. Brambleberry's Flexi Fast Molding Putty takes 30 minutes to dry. Let this cure for a minimum of 30 minutes before you try to peel the plastic off and take your erasers out. Now, take those erasers out carefully. Mm -hmm. Wasn't that easy? Just imagine how quickly your soap's gonna come out of these flexible molds. All right, it's time to make some soap. Impress your teachers, impress your friends, here we go. This project is really simple. All we need is just a few ingredients. Non-bleeding liquid red from Brambleberry, white melt and pour soap base, vanilla color stabilizer, and bubblegum flavor oil. Regular store-bought extracts don't fragrance your soap. This is a Brambleberry flavor oil and it actually can work as a fragrance oil as well. Melt the soap in the microwave on 30 second increments. Now that the soap is fully melted, it's time to add the bubblegum flavor oil. I'm going to use right around three milliliters for this amount of soap. Then, Vanilla Color Stabilizer. If you're unfamiliar with Vanilla Color Stabilizer, please refer to episode seven for more information about this really useful product. And some non-bleeding red. Let's just try a few drops to see what color we get. 
It looks pretty good, but could use a little bit more red to get that true eraser pink. There, that looks like a pretty good pink, doesn't it? Take your mold, place it on a flat surface. Now, just pour the soap into it. Spritz with rubbing alcohol and you're all done. Do you want to make your teacher feel extra special? Make a customized label for her. See, here we have cute customized labels and you can say whatever you want. In my case, I am going to say, I love school because it's true, I did. Cut this out, wrap it around your soap, take a little bit of tape, affix it to the back, there you go. Customized, perfect soap that's going to make any teacher want to give you an A. Thanks for joining me on this special edition of Soap Queen TV. I hope you learned something about how you can make customized soap molds for anyone using Brambleberry's Flexi Fast Molding Putty. It's $30 and makes 8 to 20 different soap molds. Until next time, happy soaping. And remember kids, be cool, stay in school. I'm going to show you how to make a perfectly amazing, customizable bar of soap for anything your teacher likes. Does she like horses? You can make her a horse bar. Does she like apples? You can make her an apple bar. What? <laughs> <laughs>